I am going to be talking about violence and death of black girls and women that goes unnoticed essentially in our society. So let me start with a caveat. Black men and native men are killed at higher rates than anyone else in the country. And so to talk about black girls and women who have a lower rate of being killed is not to say that I don't think the death and killing of black men are important issues to discuss. But what I hope to accomplish is to get us to thinking about how black girls and women are also important to help us consider and be aware that black women and girls are the backbone of the black community. They're the people who support all of the causes. Most of the anti-violence against black men causes were, co were uh, developed by black women. The civil rights actions have all had supported black, black women who often went unacknowledged. So when I talk about black women, it is not to minimize the um, horrors that affect um, other, uh, that affect men of color, but it's merely to get us to begin to focus on a group that we uh, almost never uh, consider as important enough to consider. Because of the theme of the conference, I took a look at the Ferguson Report. And so um, hopefully these topics I'm going to cover, uh, I'm gonna talk some about the Ferguson Report and police violations of black women's constitutional rights. Um, I talk about these things because what happened in Ferguson seems to happen nationally. I want to talk about gender violence uh, against uh, and gender violence against black women and girls. Uh, and I may mention white women as I do that by way of comparison. I want to talk about invisib invisibility theory as a psychological paradigm for explaining why no one cares about the fate of black women. I will talk about race and gender because when we talk about uh, killing of African Americans, that's what we say, African Americans. And people hear African Americans to mean African American men. We rarely see the statistics separated by gender. And then I will conclude, hopefully, with what's a black woman supposed to do? Uh, maybe you'll give me the answers to those questions.